The wettest months in the Pantanal force a turning of the tides. Fortunes reverse. Even the most dangerous creatures must adapt or die. The anaconda spray has spread wide in the floods. The giant snake must leave the water to search out something new to eat. If it finds a large animal, it may survive through the difficult months ahead. smells something living. A nest carefully constructed above flood level with nothing moving nearby. Worth investigating. But the risk, even to this super snake, is deadly. Cayman mothers are fiercely protective. There's no chance to ambush her unawares. The anaconda moves on to find an easier meal. Falling water level brings the anaconda back to the streams it prefers. It can hunt the hordes of fish as they return, or animals coming to the banks to drink. A good meal will last it for days, or even months, if the prey is sizable. Hidden air sacs by its lungs I mean it can stay below the surface for 10 minutes at a time. It senses vibrations ahead on the stream bed. It hasn't eaten for weeks and will tackle a caiman if it gets a chance. The giant snake just needs to get close enough for an ambush. It hasn't given up yet. So many fish back in the rivers mean good times for those who depend on them for food, like otters and caimans. Any animal that relaxes its guard will pay with its life. Crocodilian versus giant constrictor is a battle that has raged for 60 million years. <laughs> 